Imagine a world where Earth's atmosphere is not just a barrier but a highway that takes you to reach the stars and other solar systems, a place where humanity has unraveled the mysteries of the universe and used its inexhaustible energy to power its society, which now has free passage throughout the entire universe. This is not a Hollywood movie script, it is a reality that goes beyond the reach of our imagination. Picture yourself for a moment waking up in the morning and peering out the window to a bustling horizon, flying vehicles moving in a harmonious frenzy, resembling bees around their hive. As you step out of your room, a robotic butler greets you with a warm smile and offers you a steaming cup of coffee meticulously prepared according to your preferences. Enjoying your coffee, you stay updated on the news through augmented reality, discovering that humanity has reached a new milestone, a civilization that draws energy not from a single star but from our entire galaxy. Heading to work, you enter a transport capsule that takes you at the speed of light to your workplace, an imposing space station orbiting a nearby planet. At night, you decide to take a break and enjoy a bit of our galaxy. Boarding an elegant ship, you reach a distant planet known for its exotic delicacies. You savor dishes that challenge the senses and admire the mastery of alien chefs responsible for their creation. Upon returning home, you realize that all of this is just the beginning. Countless civilizations await out there, each more advanced and fascinating than the previous one. From Type 1 civilizations, harnessing the power of their home planet, to Type 7 civilizations, commanding the multiverse, the possibilities are infinite. What if I told you that all of this could be real and that perhaps some alien civilizations have already reached these technological heights? The journey began in 1964 when the Soviet scientist Nikola Kardashev developed a classification system grouping civilizations based on their technological progress and energy consumption. This scale, known as the Kardashev scale, ranges from type 1, representing a civilization that has not yet tapped into the full potential of its own planet, to Type 3, capable of harnessing the energy of an entire galaxy. It's a humbling realization that, despite all technological advances, we still remain at the lowest level of the Kardashev scale, proud to occupy the position of a Type 0 civilization, which has not yet reached the capacity to explore all the energy available on our planet or establish a global infrastructure for sustainable energy. Currently, humans have a score of 0.73. In 2018, our average energy consumption was 18.4 terawatts. Theoretical physicist Michio Kaku calculated that by increasing our consumption by 3% each year, we will reach a Type 1 civilization in 100 to 200 years. A Type 1 civilization dominates all available energy on its home planet, drawn from neighboring stars, using sources such as fission and fusion energy, renewable resources, interplanetary space travel, communication, megascale planetary engineering, and significant medical advancements. Despite its technological enhancements, it remains vulnerable to extinction and is not confined to a single planet, having extended its unified rule across various planets and moons in the solar system. Michio Kaku, in The Physics of the Future, explores how Type 1 civilizations harvest planetary power by utilizing all the solar energy that reaches their planet. They can control volcanoes, manipulate the climate, control earthquakes, and build cities over the ocean. This ability to control the natural world is truly impressive and highlights how much a civilization can progress when it masters energy and technology. The mention of Type 1 civilizations may suggest superpowers, but it is a mere shadow of what Type II civilizations can achieve. Have you heard of the Dyson Sphere? That's where a Type II civilization comes into play. These civilizations can harness the energy of a star by building a Dyson Sphere around it, a megastructure proposed by physicist Freeman Dyson. This sphere captures the star's energy to power the civilization's infrastructure and technology. Building a Dyson Sphere would require vast resources and advanced technology, beyond the capabilities of our current civilization. However, intriguing discoveries have raised questions about the possibility of advanced civilizations harnessing star energy. The star Tabby is a famous example, located 1470 light-years from Earth in the Cygnus constellation. 
Discovered in 2015 by the Kepler Space Telescope, this star drew attention due to its irregular light patterns, dimming up to 20% at unpredictable intervals. Astronomers speculated that this could be caused by a swarm of comets or even an alien megastructure, such as a Dyson sphere. If a civilization could build such a sphere, it would have access to an enormous amount of energy, enabling the manipulation of the star's output, the creation of artificial gravity, and even black holes. Type II civilizations could colonize entire star systems, build habitats on planets and moons, and even terraform these worlds. They would be able to manipulate planetary orbits and create their own star systems. Kardashev believed that a Type III civilization, mastering the energy of an entire galaxy, would be almost divine. A galaxy with each solar system dismantled, stars enveloped in energy-extracting solar cells. The ability to travel faster than light, manipulate gravity and electromagnetic fields, travel using unknown propulsion technology, all of this would be possible. A 2015 study suggested that such civilizations in our local universe are extremely rare, but if they exist, galaxies would be simple abodes for them, and planets mere stones in their path. They could manipulate the fabric of space-time, control stellar movements, and extract energy from cosmic phenomena like supernovas and black holes. The possibilities of reaching such a level of civilization are unimaginable. Humans are estimated to take about a million years to reach this stage, assuming we get there at all. Currently, there is no evidence of these advanced civilizations, raising two possibilities, either they don't exist, or they rapidly developed advanced technology, concealing themselves and remaining undetected. It may seem that Type I civilizations are powerful, but compared to Type II civilizations, they are modest. And what if there are even more advanced civilizations? A Type IV civilization, beyond Kardashev's original scale, imagined by some scientists, would control the energy of billions of galaxies, manipulating and rearranging planetary systems, creating or erasing what is no longer needed in the universe. Although understanding the physical laws necessary for this control is currently beyond our capability, the mere possibility is a testament to the vast potential of the universe and the endless mysteries waiting to be unraveled. However, the idea of a multiverse is not new and has been speculated by scientists and philosophers for centuries. What if there is a civilization that not only discovered other universes but also found a way to harness their energy? A Type V civilization could control the energy of infinite universes, transferring it between dimensions and performing teleportation and time travel as everyday routines. It may seem unbelievable, but a Type VI civilization would exist outside of space and time, creating and destroying universes and multiverses instantly. Reaching this level would be like becoming practically divine, controlling everything. In the distant future, humanity has reached the pinnacle of its evolution, becoming a Type VII civilization with technology available to unlock the secrets of the universe and, with it, the secret of immortality. Members of the Omega civilization would use virtual technology to travel through various pocket dimensions. By bending spacetime, they would create a void that would serve as a new home for objects relocated from the existing universe. Each unique pocket dimension would offer unique experiences, with different physical laws that could be explored. Programming each atom, the Omega civilization could exist indefinitely in the pocket universe. When this universe eventually disappeared, they could shift to a universe within the pocket universe, perpetuating themselves indefinitely. The Omega civilization would be the master of its own destiny, transcending time and space. Beings of pure energy, capable of traveling between dimensions at will, would continue to surpass the limits of what is possible with each new discovery. But even with all this grandeur, there is something else to be explored. Have you ever contemplated the pyramids, structures that have withstood the test of time and continue to inspire? What if I told you that there was an advanced civilization millions of years before ours? Scientists, studying the Great Pyramid, ponder what would be necessary to build such a wonder millennia ago. Many believe that 20,000 workers and two decades were required. 
this seems a remarkable feat when we consider that they used only rudimentary tools. Precise details of the pyramid make it difficult to believe that such a magnificent structure was completed in 20 years with so few people and limited resources. Even with modern tools, scientists have been unable to replicate the pyramids with the same precision, indicating that the techniques employed by this ancient civilization surpass our current understanding. This civilization, known as the Omega Civilization, possessed advanced knowledge that challenges our understanding of human history. The traces of this lost civilization extend beyond the Egyptian pyramids. Archaeological sites around the world reveal inexplicable structures and artifacts, indicating an advanced presence that silently shaped the course of history. This Omega civilization developed a form of conscious energy that permeated all things, a kind of life force that could be manipulated and directed. This energy was the foundation of their technology, allowing them to carve stones with atomic precision, effortlessly erect colossal structures, and even alter matter itself as they wished. Over millennia, humanity forgot these ancient knowledge, plunging into the darkness of ignorance. However, fragments of this legacy survived, intertwined in myths and legends of ancient civilizations. Narratives of divine beings, gods who shaped the world at their will, are vestiges of the achievements of the Omega civilization. As archaeologists unearth more evidence and decipher ancient esoteric texts, the truth about this civilization begins to emerge. Technological advancements that we associate with the future were already achieved and then lost in the flow of time. Now, in an effort to understand and rediscover these lost technologies, humanity embarks on a journey of rediscovery. Academic institutions and research centers join forces to decipher the secrets of Omega artifacts, seeking to bring to light a new era of knowledge and progress. As scientists come closer to unraveling the mysteries of the Omega civilization, a new hope for the future arises. The fusion of advanced technology with fundamental human values may finally lead humanity to the next stage of its evolution. While humanity unveils the secrets of the Omega civilization, a new era of innovation in consciousness emerges. The ancient structures, once seen as inexplicable monuments, become silent witnesses to humanity's journey toward understanding its own potential. And so, amid ancient ruins and advanced technology, humanity advances toward a future where the achievements of the Omega civilization are not just relics of the past but springboards to the next chapter of its evolution. An evolution driven by lost wisdom, now rediscovered, that elevates humanity to new heights of understanding and achievements. This is the story of a world where the past and the future intertwine, where the quest for the unknown reveals not only who we were but who we can become. The firmament, once seen only as a covering, now becomes a passage to the stars, guiding humanity toward a cosmic destiny beyond any previous imagination.